how to set up your CRM to push contacts over to that CRM from Lead411. The first thing you'll want to do when you get into your paid account is click on your name in the right hand corner and go to account settings. In the account settings you'll look for a field called setup CRM for exports um, and today let's use HubSpot for the example. Um, so we'll here we'll go down look for HubSpot and then we'll click on credentials. So you'll put in your API key. If you need help on finding that API key there will be a help link that you can click on that will show you where to request that. Once you have that API key in here you can hit test and as long as the credentials come back as correct that's all you need to do. So I'm just going to hit save in here and then it will save HubSpot as my default CRM. I can also customize the data mapping so if I click on this edit this is what will pop up all of these custom fields I have inside of my HubSpot that you can map over to any one of the Lead411 employee or company fields. This will be similar for some other systems out there like Salesforce, um, Dynamics, um, just a few that I know also have that data mapping option. So once you have everything saved and you have this selected as your default CRM, this little radio button, we'll just go in here and then we'll hit save and everything should be set up. So then I'll also pull up a list I already have built and show you how to customize your button. So I'm going to go in here, say contacts with emails, direct dials. So when I build this list, it still says add to cart. And that's if you want to get push them to the shopping cart to download as an Excel or CSV file. If you want to push them to HubSpot, I can click on the drop down. And that's where HubSpot will pop up. But I also, if I scroll down to the bottom, it says customize this menu. So in customize this menu, I can actually customize that button instead of it saying add to cart. I can have that function be pushed to HubSpot. So then if I have that saved, I'll build this list again, different list. Um, so now I can push these contacts right into HubSpot where it says get data pushed to HubSpot. Um, it's showing red because again it knows that I've already exported these contacts before. Um, but that will be how to set up the export into your CRM from Lead411.